When hunting, the Gila monster taps into its incredible sense of smell to locate and dig up eggs buried nearly half a foot into the ground. It can even track a trail made by a rolling egg. Once caught, the prey is crushed to death in the reptile's jaws, or if small enough, eaten alive. But the search for food isn't restricted to the ground. Gila monsters will climb trees and cacti to find eggs. The Gila monster makes venom in saliva glands located in its mouth. They don't have fangs, so instead of a single strike, they gnaw to inject venom. The chewing action draws the venom from the gland to the tooth and into the victim. April to June is an exciting time in the Gila monster's world. It's when the males wrestle to decide who gets the ladies. These matches can go on for hours until one is overpowered and pinned to the ground. Despite their sharp claws and killer bites, most of the time, both participants walk away unscathed. Their venom is a neurotoxin that's as potent as a coral snake's, but the Gila monster makes only small amounts. Gila monsters mainly prey on helpless creatures and eggs, so it's believed their venom has evolved as a defense mechanism, and their bright colors warn others of their toxicity. Its ferocious appearance, combined with its sharp claws, intense bite, and lethal venom make this desert dweller a real-life monster. <laughs>